Hi guys, my name is Jeanette and welcome to my channel. In today's video we're going to talk about how to be classy. This video is not to infuriate you, this is to inspire you. So, I'm sorry if it comes across that way. I am new to YouTube and I upload videos once a week. So if you want to follow me on my journey for YouTube and all things great, please follow along and don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. Anyway, let's get into today's video. Now today, I want to express to you how much I don't think being classy is a negative thing. I think that being classy is like a granny thing. I necessarily don't feel it that way. For me, I think it's the creme de la creme. It's the woman that you aspire to be. The best version of you could be. So today's video, this is a star guide into my star. So I bought a rack system specifically for YouTube. Um, from Ikea, by the way, 1995. <laughs> um, just to show you um, and present them in a nicer way. But I'll um, show you what I mean. So let's get to point number one. Point number one. We're going to talk about the length of your skirt. Now, I'm not going to tell you don't wear them too short or don't wear them too long because I used to go clubbing myself. I mean, I still do, but not as nowhere near as much as I used to. And I found it quite hard to wear like clubby outfits classily. You know, like it's very, I find it's a bit too much to show. Like, but even back in the day, like 10 years ago, I found it was too much to show, too obvious. And for me, it's not what is obvious. Like, Sexy is not what I can see, sexy is what is hidden. And I found wearing like mini skirts, it's quite hard to, you know, wear clubbing. So mini skirts I used to wear. Or even just like up to, you know, <sighs> above the knee. So um, I completely understand that. So I decided to buy a tutu myself for my birthday. I wore shorts underneath, of course, because that's what a classy lady does. <laughs> but in this instance, in regards to the length of your skirt, I mean is wear what you've got but own it. But well, wear what's custom to you. So in this case, I decided to buy a tutu, but I, in regards to the top bit, I, I balanced that out. So probably I would like I wear shorts under this, but I'd probably wear something a bit more covered, probably like a shirt on top, just to balance out the fact that I'm wearing and showing a lot of leg. Same thing when it goes to a mini skirt. I find mini skirts are better because I'm quite short, so I find they're better, and you can wear a lot of different kind kind of tops which I'm going to show you in a minute and they'll look very classy you can wear them like going out for coffee going to a business meeting going out for brunch or something like even just like putting on a tee nice midi like even like this and just put on a pair of sandals and you're good to go doesn't matter if you don't like them if that short that's fine there's a midi skirt there's a maxi maxi skirt um they're good too and like I said it's not about what you wear it's how you wear it I find um classy classy it's not a bad thing okay we're not talking about the skirts let's talk about pants like uh, little leggings i'll probably wear something a bit more showing like one shot on the top which i'll show you in a second you know put the hair on the side a nice little bit of little bit of shoulder by showing but not too much which is what the definition of classy is all about on to option number two um texture you know it's not something that you probably hear of a lot but um one of my two of my style icons are either Audrey Hepburn and Coco Chanel. Coco Chanel brand, obviously the infamous Chanel brand that we are well known of. She started the iconic brand and with her love of black and her accessorizing and her red lipstick, it's what inspires me every day. I love my fair share of black. If you follow me on Instagram, you know what I'm talking about. That's the only shade I really like. I do pop a bit of color, but not as much. I'm getting there. But in regards to texture, I bought this tweed jacket from Zara. This is a bit old, about five, six years old, but love it. I've been wearing it since. A plain tee from Kmart, plain je jeans, jeggings, underpants, whatever you like. Chuck this on, instantly elevates and makes it look classy. Because for me personally, Coco Chanel is the definition of classy. Shut up after boot too. But on to the next texture bit, I'm talking about pleats. I find that adds instant class. If you're wondering why the, um, it's different, I've got two skirts, so I pack them together when they're similar. It's a little wardrobe pack there. But um, like adding pleats just adds instant class. No matter what colour, whatever what style, even like a mini skirt in a pleat, still adds instant class, adds the elevation, the classiness that transpires and makes it effortless. Here to another texture, back on a tutu. Um, just the whole like rouging of the, the whole skirt. I sometimes wear this like um, 
I did for a photo shoot. I did like this wall, like a skater skirt on top, just to show you. And I showed the bit of the tutu, to say it looks like a bit of texture. Updated the, updated the, it's called skater skirt, you know. But it's still like I didn't have to do a lot to work, which is quite good. On to the next one, tops. Um, I find a certain style of tops adds into the class to our outfit. Um, simple skirt, simple um, simple outfit, but adding these kinds of tops adds into the class. So for me, going out, like I said uh, previously, I found it really hard to dress classy while going out. So I found that one shoulder tops are really demure. Well, also like styling it really nicely, um, adding with a nice pair of jeans, nice pair of blinky heels if that's what you like. Adding it, chucking into a skirt, putting the pants, anything you like, but it just adds that into the class because you're showing a bit of skin, not but not showing too much. And saying that, I'm talking about the, also the halter neck, the classic halter neck, um, shows the shoulders. So if you got a really nice decolletage, decolletage, does anyone know how to say that word actually? Um, this one's a bit different. This is actually really covered, so it's got a bit of a split there, um, and it shows the arms quite nicely, but not showing too much. Again, tuck it to a skirt into the pants, nice belt, whatever you like. And last but not least, I find that adding a peplum top is also really classy too. And um, for those girls that have got a bit of tummy, don't worry, I got it. Um, I find that peplum, I've mentioned this before in previous videos, I'll link that down below, but um, it cuts at the stomach so it actually covers everything, so with that it adds dimension to the stomach without actually showing, showing that gut of yours. If you have a big lunch, the peplums are perfect for you, but they also add into the class to your outfit. On to the next one, I find accessories add real a lot of, a lot of elevation to your outfit, whilst also being really classy. This is actually a fake verse, so don't, don't worry. Um, I bought this in regards because, like I said, I love Audrey Hepburn and Coco Chanel. In fact, that whole 1950s era, like Marilyn Monroe, the whole Grace Kelly movement, really classy, really elegant, something you don't really see this day and age. But with the, while it's just going out for like, like a nice night out, nice tea, nice jeans, nice pair of heels, this instantly elevates an outfit and makes it look really ultra glam. I wore this to many weddings because I'm European, we have a big family, so we have heaps of cousins getting married, which I'm really happy about. But with adding that, it added me look really glam. I wore a simple out little back dress because I really didn't have time to buy anything. So adding that just added that extra glam, extra elegance, that um, classiness as well. Something that we'll, I haven't actually got here with me is a perfect shade of lipstick for you. Doesn't matter if it's nude, pink nude, 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 red, orange, purple, even or even a dark brown. Whatever suits your skin tone and your hair color, I find it really complements your skin. That is perfect. Even if a signature scent, I find my Coco Chanel Mademoiselle is my signature scent. It speaks to me, not literally, obviously, but it speaks to me and it just feels like it describes me quite well. It's a bit fruity, a bit sweet, but also pats a punch and lasts a long, long time. I can wear that put the top item in the wash and still have it on the same item which is great I don't have to worry about it too much it's worth the money for me personally also find that Rihanna is a beautiful classy elegant set for me that I could wear day in day out no, no worries even if I'm a bit tight on the money this is actually really cheap at price line so I have no worries there also something that's not in the rack I really want to say classy is not actually about your outfits it is also about the heart that you have i.e. talking ill of someone. Talking bad about someone is probably one of the most unclassiest things you could do to someone or about them. I find that being honest with them or not talking about anyone behind their back or if you're going to talk about them, actually confront them and tell them of the issue is one of the most classiest things you could ever do in this day and age. It's not something that's come up often but with that in mind that adds to this outfit. No matter what outfit you put together, if you talk bad about someone or are talking ill of them it actually ruins the whole outfit so just keep that in mind but thank you for tuning in if you watched today's video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up i'll be seeing you next week um, i left all my blog and my social media links down below i've also left some blog posts down below if you're interested and just seeing some more style inspiration of how i styled some of these items i all my outfits i have bought if i have not i have mentioned it down below in the blog post below but thanks for tuning in again don't forget to subscribe i'll see you all next week bye